today is, is that we always end up on the same path. Okay. Now what happens is, at the end of the day, what are issues? Are the issues to do with our cultural or environmental issues? Or are they to do with the fact that of religion? What happens is, I want to tell you something here. My dad is a Freemason. Until we start talking about Freemasons, we cannot get through. We cannot break that complete, what do you want to call Call it, it's corruption. Okay. Okay. They are the ones that are hiding so much information from us. Okay. What do you want us to do? We can't do anything until we say. We can't do anything, can we? Until we say no more Freemasons, no more secret societies. Um, and that for me is very hard. Let me tell you now, for me to talk like this, I've lost my inheritance. I've lost my son. He has to live with his auntie. I've lost uh, my... I wasn't allowed to see my mum before she died. Okay, mm -hmm. let me tell you now, they're naughty, naughty people, very naughty, and please don't laugh, okay, please don't laugh, okay, We've been warned. because we are dealing with some very sick people who are controlling us. Now, what I want you to understand is that we do have, I believe, every religion adds an amount to the same thing, okay, now I'm not saying that it's easy for us to understand. But what I am saying is that you can easily go and find that we have everything in common, okay? But that takes years. Sometimes it depends on the individual. Correct. Okay? And all I know is from my understanding of how I've lived, how I was brought up, unfortunately, these religions and also philosophies and also yeah, I, th I think at the end of the day, we have to try and understand what is a philosophy, okay? okay? It's very difficult sometimes, isn't it? We don't know. Is Hinduism, Sikhism, are they philosophies, are they real, or are they religions? And I think that's where we struggle, you know? And at the end of the day, I absolutely, in my heart, I believe that all of these religions, we are all the same, and we all come, and unfortunately, we lead into yeah. that same pyramid, unfortunately. And what we need to do is we need to find a way. How can we set ourselves free? How, how can we set ourselves free? You know, it's very difficult. It's a very good thinking and reflection. We should all work together to worship the one true God. We should all work together to worship the one true God. We should all come back to the worship of one God. Indeed, indeed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now, Do you want me to go? <laughs> you can listen now. No, no. So here is... Here is Edward. But then I put this on YouTube, by the way. Don't worry, don't worry. Because like said Freemasons talked about my dad. Don't worry, don't worry. If you want to be on YouTube, you can be on YouTube. No problem. They won't. They won't. Now, you're already live. You're already live. You're already live. Sweet. Right. Thank so, you. freedom of speech. Right. Well right. Done. Here is the. Oh, great. Van Gogh's my inheritance. Here is uh, Edward Lane's lexicon. He continues. Edward Lane continues, like here. When you say this, he blessed him, meaning he invoked God's blessings upon him, namely the Prophet. Where he says, Allah masalli alayhi. Explained by what here flows, follows, according to the renderings of sallu alayhi, i.e., Alan Nabi by BD and others in the Quran one says Sallaytu Alan Nabi I blessed the Prophet and said of God he blessed him meaning he conferred blessing upon him that he had mercy on him wouldn't that word be better place to support one, one second we can't just give a meaning when the deck language oh, doesn't if you if you allow me to finish this dictionary entry first, thank you. No problem. So, so can so, you give people salah? So lay to Alan Nabi and and, and, and said of God, so you, and he had so mercy on him that, that you he say? magnified so him. Asking, can you give and, someone excuse salah? me, and he conferred honor upon him. Hence the saying, <laughs> Allahumma salli ala Ali Abi Awfa, meaning Oh God, bless the family of Abu Awfa. Or have mercy on him. This is what he's saying as an evidence. Look, when Allahumma salli ala, oh Allah, have salah 
on Abi Alpha. Is that saying, oh Allah, pray on Abi Alpha? Of course not. Every Arab would laugh, laugh at your attempt of translating, you know, with your own, you know, I don't know what kind of translation you're getting from, that it means prayer here, because Allahumma salli ala Ali Abi Alpha means, oh Allah, blessed the family of Abu Alpha, or have mercy on him. But in the saying in the Quran, in Allah wa malaikatahu yisalluna ala nabi, the verb does not import two meanings, for it has there only one meaning, which is, oh, oh, it's giving a meaning. Edward Lane is giving the meaning in this authoritative dictionary. Do you want to know what that meaning is? Is it prayer? No. What is it giving? What? He says, he says, for the only meaning which is magnification these words mean verily god and his angels magnify the prophet or rather i would render them blessed the prophet bless the prophet as this rendering implies magnification and also a meaning of the quasi um inf noun infinitive noun given in the m and k these are the dictionaries his authorities which is eulogy or commendation bestowed by god upon his angels while it is imports god's conferring of blessing and the angels invoking thereof so allah masulli ala muhammad means oh god magnify muhammad in the present world and by exalt is his renown and magnifying manifesting his invitation to al islam and rendering permanent his law and in the world to come by accepting his intercession and so on. So Edward Lane clearly says the word Sallu ala, Yusalluna ala here in the context and in the Quran means magnifying and he says I will render it as blessing. Blessing. Because when you magnify and give you know privilege to someone and honor someone, confer an advantage to someone, this is what it means. Instead of yeah, yeah. Instead of going back to the classical dictionaries, which has this meaning, you go to what? Tom, Dick and Harry, Arab experts who don't even know Arabic can say like last week, while you came to me, I ignored you because, because I had to go to the Arabic, what Isalluna Allah means. Then one of your friend, supposedly an expert Arab, came and said, you know what? Yeah. I have a dictionary, Yusuf Ali. I was about to laugh dead. Excuse my, excuse me. Speak Arabic fluently in order to understand the No, no. What I'm saying, I know you're trying to put your two cents in. What I'm saying is, I am saying, I am saying, dude, I'm a Muslim. You are a Muslim. Call me a brother. So what I'm saying is. I am saying, I am saying, Arabic is essential. When there is a dispute in the meaning of a word, it is essential that we go to the Arabic dictionary. So now I have established, let me summarize. I have established from more than 50 English translations where they translate, whether they are Muslims or non-Muslims, they will use the word blessings because that's the word that is conferred within this meaning you saluna ala nabi i gave you an authoritative dictionary classical dictionary edward lanes and i told you if you really think what this word means go to the classical dictionaries lisan al arab which you are now going to give me the meaning from qamus al muhit which you're going to give me the meaning from as siha taj al urus and muhtar al siha if you don't give me those meanings from those classical Arabic dictionaries, instead, go to your friend, Tom, Dick and Harry, not acceptable. Instead, you go to a modern dictionary with a modern terms, not acceptable. We want authoritative dictionaries of classical Arabic. I've given you four examples. I would expect definitions from these four. And I expect you to answer them, not just waffle. So all of you listen. What I demanded of her is this. The meaning of the word, Yusalluna ala, Yusalluna li, right? Sallali, from the classical Arabic dictionaries. And we expect at least from one of them. If she doesn't provide the definitions 
from any of those classical Arabic dictionaries yeah. and she dismisses all these 50 plus English translations by Muslims and non-Muslims then the discussion ends here by saying you are a woman Decepticon Carry on. May Jesus grant Allah's praise. Amen. Yeah. Watch out for the answer from the so, victories. Let, let, let me just summarize no, what I happened. Approximate, I would say maybe Allah's 10 minutes. Approximate 10 Amen. minutes. We had, we had shish kebab here. We, in, alongside shish kebab. No, no, hatun kebab. Hatun we kebab. had a baklava <laughs> here. Hatun kebab. But have you noticed? Yeah. There is response, but no answer to my question. What monster did was not only butcher his own Quran, yeah. he went to English translations. <laughs> he went to English translations, and English translation translates it as a blessing. Yeah. Yet we all know what is the Arabic word for blessing. Yeah, that is not. Yes, Sulana or Salat, whatever, however you pronounce it. Proper pronunciation. Proper pronunciation. Yes, Sulana. No, you're wrong. Yeah, but you have to read the Quran within context. The meaning changes slightly. Ma'am, excuse me. So, while Quran doesn't have the context, I cannot expect Muslims to produce context for me. He wants me to go to the dictionaries. I am. I made it much easier for him, but that was before he left his ears at home. I gave him the Islamic tradition, how their own scholars translated. I gave you Ibn Kathir. Aye. Ibn Kathir uses word for blessing and for prayer. And Ibn Kathir states Allah Praise doesn't bless Allah. Praise. I am sorry, you are butchering your Ibn Kathir, who you used to depend on. Who used to depend on. I am so sorry to see, actually, again, you just butchered other traditions too. There is a different meaning praying and blessing. It's not only Muhammad Hijab confirmed for us. Muslims don't even ask Muhammad Hijab to apologize yeah. since lying about Islam. I know my English is horrible. I'm so sorry my English is horrible. But I broke broken English. There is no answer to question. Let's use the English speaker to ask my question once again. My English speaker is going to translate what I am saying, okay? Is he like your Tafsir? Tafsir uses different word for prayer and blessing. Tafsir tells us Allah prays for sending the blessings. Can you please translate that phrase and ask Mansur why he is is he becoming apostate? Oh. Can you please ask Mansur? There is five pages. There is five pages. Tells us the word meaning is prayer used in the Quran. Can you ask him who is the one who hears the prayer of Allah if it is not human beings? Who is that? If Mansur is becoming apostate again, can you please tell us what about the timidity? Why is everything, birds, fish, animals, all things are praying? That is, this time I'm going to English translation, and English translation translates that as translate that as prayer. What are you going to do for the prayers Allah does for the self-control? Overall, Allah prays. Overall, Islamic tradition messed up. Overall, Islamic Dawah can stand and confirm that Islamic
Islamic Dawatim with Which all of it Islam messed up. <laughs> so now she gets nightmares. I'm going to break it down. Surah 339. Pray it. Same word, guys. Surah 4, verse 102. Pray. Surah 4, 4, 102. And let them pray. Surah 9, verse 84. You pray. Surah 9, verse 103. And bless. Surah 33, verse 43. Surah 33, verse 56. Surah 75, verse 31. Surah 87, verse 15. 75 what? Slow down, I can't get you on there. Slow down. This is a useless one. 75 what? Verse 2. Surah 2, verse 43. Surah 2, 43. Verse 45. What is the point of saying these things when I can't even take the references down? The same theme and two. You read 56 translations. I can show you all of them again. Verse 153. Surah 2, verse 157. Surah 2, verse 157. Surah 2, Surah 2, verse 238. Surah 2, 277. Surah 4, 43. Surah 4, 77. Surah 4, verse 110. Surah 4, verse 1. Verse 101, Surah 4, verse 102, Surah 4, verse 103, Surah 4, verse 142, Surah 4, verse 162, Surah 4, verse 6, Surah 5, verse 12, 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 Surah 5, Six ninety two, six one hundred sixty two, six seven one hundred seventy. This is what you obvious. Carry on. People will laugh at the end. Don't worry. Carry on. No hard Nine seventy one. Nine ninety nine. Muhammad. Oh. I would go My question is, God why would Allah pray. pray 
That's yeah, my why? question. Yeah, why Allah does God pray? prays. Why does Allah why does God pray? pray? But Muhammad is God. And especially for Muhammad. Because Remember, it's not only Muhammad, <laughs> it's also, also <laughs> root words, branches. Changes Are you teaching us? I'm informing you. I am so sorry. I'm 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 confirms the word means is the prayer translations of the tafsir translations of the quran confirms it is prayer if the kadir tells us 33 56 translation in the tafsir of ibn kadir allah prays allah doesn't do the blessing allah does the praying Allah praise. Allah praise. Allah praise. Okay, now Til I'm going to respond. 1387. Oh, Till mid 2685. Yes. They all, all, all tell us. You have it an answer, Mr. Yeah, it's God's answer. And then we go ahead and stand in Turkish. I will expose your shame in public and of your ignorance of Arabic first. language right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gets worse. Oh, you yeah. have to expose us. Muslim yeah, 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 wants yeah, yeah. to <laughs> expose our Arabic. Remember Seashell? You it forgot him? It is the same Muslim. Let's find yourself on that one. It is the so, same Muslim. Let's find that one, man. So, went to 53 English translation. Did anyone heard what is the meaning of the blessings and praying in Arabic? Not from Muslim. Salah, but salah, what they baraka. mean prayer, blessing mean the Greek, baraka. Yeah. 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 So he's a liar. Allah. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Hadouk. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Hebrew or Allah Arabic? Pray. doesn't do baraka. In the Arabic That's language, since when Allah the word salah is not doing the baraka, comes with a preposition, like Allah. 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 Still stands. I'm sorry, Who is the hero of the prayer? In the Arabic language. So, sister, let me just change the question. Just a moment. In the Arabic language, I'm going to focus on it. In the Arabic language, when the verb salah is salah, is accompanied with a I feel there is an intention. Like a heart of jar. Intentionally, ah, just me. moving on from me, from it changes the meaning to of the other person. So, when you say you say Luna Allah, is the same meaning or different meaning Allah as prays. Salawat and Salah? Different meaning. Different meaning. Allah because prays. Arabic language is specific when it comes to its preposition modifier. Yeah? So when you say Salah, you don't mean Salah with Saad, Lam, Aleph, and Taya Marbuta. So you didn't understand what we're discussing. Now, okay. Now, so now my response. So, Allah prays. Okay, so can, Allah she can take as many. Allah prays. Right. That's only right. Man. Here is my no response. Answer, Here's my response. No answer to Hadith. Okay. No answer to the word. Right. No, I didn't hear him. Like, how many times? Allah is praying. Right. right. So now. Last response. Let's give him grace. Let's give him a chance. Right. This is your last chance. Right. 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 Right one to one. Yeah. If she wants to discuss with Brother Shamsi, mashallah, yeah, Brother Shamsi will wipe the floor with our hands at him. Don't worry. Right. 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 No? Now, remember, remember, I asked her, do you remember what I said? Yeah. This discussion will be over, and I call her Decepticon, if she fails to provide either from one of those four classical Arabic dictionaries. I gave you the, the tafsir. You are I gave you the Islamic tradition. You are behaving like a very uncivilized she gave individual. Islamic traditions, my soul. So I would have to say simply, Hatun, 
please shut up and listen. Thank you. Now, thank you. Now, thank you. You make your point quick. Right. Oh, you put from here to there. I'm not a good speaker. Right. Why? Why they don't care? Let's give him two minutes. 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 Now, so I said. This discussion will be over yeah. and she will call to the Decepticon if he fails to provide the meaning of the word Salla Yusallu Ala from what? Not from me, not from Brother Hijab. He did a very good job. Not <laughs> very, from, very good. <laughs> not from himself, bro. any individuals here and there, but from authoritative classical Arabic dictionaries such as Lisan al Arab, Taj al Arus. Qamus al muhid Siha al-Siha, or Mukhtar al-Siha. I gave these examples. Did she provide the meaning of the word from those authoritative dictionaries? She didn't. Next thing I said, does she agree with more than 50 translations, Muslims and non-Muslims, on the word Yusalluna Allah, translated by them as blessings, mercy, elevation, and so on? She did not agree with any one of them. Instead, what she did was look, carried on from reading the English translations of Ibn Kathir what he said, Tirmidhi what he said. Now, I haven't examined Ibn Kathir and Tirmidhi yet. What I was asking her for her third evidence is corpus, Arabic corpus, which she said, no, she's not going to say. Guess what I did? I brought the evidence myself on my own phone. Would you like to see so now I am going to now examine this evidence that she provided right. and show to you how deceptive she is Indeed. in providing evidence to you and deceiving you all. No, that's right. just now, her understanding. Yes. Not being deceptive. That's her okay. understanding. I agree, I agree. Okay. Her understanding of why this is wrong and based on that wrong understanding, she's misleading others. Now here, Arabic corpus says the word Sad Lam Wow, the triliteral root. The same page she didn't want me to show, which I now have on my phone. Now, this triliteral root occurs 99 times. Ooh. 12 times. Prayer, prayer, prayer. The prayer, Excuse me. The prayer, the prayer, Is she going to allow me to speak or what? The prayer, the prayer, the prayer. Wait, wait, slow, 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 slow,